Hi, my name is David John. This is my 92nd elevator pitch for the Dutch postcode lottery. Uh, actually, an elevator is a good uh, example because elevators are something that when we think of a gravity-powered engine, you think of something that people try to recoup power from something as it falls and you know figure some way magically to get it back to the top and of course it's something that's been uh, pursued for thousands of years by thousands of people uh, actually Leonardo da Vinci one of my greatest idols uh, looked into this for a period of time and then he concluded that it was not something that was possible it's actually interesting uh, the things he did. They're all they're great things. They're very classic designs. It's uh, sometimes funny, sometimes painful to see people build them today and say, "Look at this new invention." <laughs> but regardless, I don't want to go there. Uh, we know the problem with anybody who tries to make power from gravity. And that is, no matter what uh, elevator or whatever analogy you want to use, you have, you go downhill. It doesn't matter if it's hydropower, it doesn't matter what form of power, uh, there's always the concept that you have to, you, you go down the hill, and then at some point, and this is where all scientists and all of us laugh and, and get a good chuckle, uh, we know you have to go back up the hill. I mean, that's an irrefutable point. You can play games, you can do all kinds of trickery, but you have to get back up the hill. And that is conventional thinking. Now, in 90 seconds, we obviously can't cover a, a gravity engine that actually works, which is the John device. But just very briefly, conceptually, people always face the struggle of going back uphill. Well, the John device moves the hill, not the weight. The weight is moved as a function of its interaction with the Earth's gravity in this case, but the John device doesn't move the weight, the John device moves the hill itself. So obviously no one could believe uh, a gravity engine in a 90 second pitch and uh, I wouldn't expect them to which is why on David W. John on YouTube there are a number of videos more than an hour's worth uh, showing the device and a number of forms, weights, variations and so forth uh, and then also www.thejohndevice.com has the links uh, to those also. So I hope you enjoy the John device. Who says you have to go back uphill? <laughs> Just move the hill and let nature take its course.